everybody, it's Miss Charlotte here. Today we're going to do our RAD pre-primary ballet class. But first of all, let me see who I've got with us today. So I should have Scarlett. Hello, Scarlett. Hello, Imogen. Hello, Olivia. Hello, Ellen. Hello, Lucy. Hello, Florence. Hello, Susanna. Hello, Kate. And hello, Pippa. Hello, Seawall. And I hope you love your pre-primary ballet class today. We're going to start off with our warm up so gluing those feet together into parallel position, arms down by your side. Now, if you have some tea towels like Miss Charlotte, I will show you these. You can use these for your warm up instead of the shaker. So, to shake up and then shake down and then big rise up and big spin. But there's a rule if you use the tea towels, you have to clean all those dishes for the grown-ups at home. So arms down by your side, we'll go through our warm-up. Four shakes up, one, two, three, four. Shaking down, keeping the feet glued together into parallel position. Strong rise up, make sure that tummy's in. Big smile, one slow spin. And then start again, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, big surprise, big spin and stop. Now we do our run around, but when we do our run around, make sure you're nice and high on those tiptoes. Nice strong arms. Up you go, run. One, two, three, four, and stop. Hold, and again. One, two, three, four, and stop. And down. Shall we try that with some music? So nice and strong, gluing those feet together. Arms down by your side, big, big smiles. Here we go. Here we go. Shake and hide those hands behind your back. 
Now each finger needs to kiss your thumb, okay? Now when you stretch those arms out, make sure they're not too far down. They need to be right up so everybody can see with nice long fingers. How long can you get your fingers? Nice and long, so Peter Pointer, Toby Tall, Ruby Ring and Baby Small. And try the other one, 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 change two, change three, change four. Let me get both together. One and two and three and four. We pick now from here. They could be glitter, smarties, flowers, anything you want to pick off the floor. So you're going to pick up off the floor and throw up to the sky beautifully and watch everything fall softly. And then we start all over again. All right. So just the little things you need to remember. Keep that arm up with nice long fingers. Make sure you're not sitting like a goblin. You need to stretch nice and tall and hide those toes away. And one last really good thing, remember to smile. So here we go, nice and strong. Here we go. Well done. 
Now then we don't want to go too fast, but we don't want slow ponies now, do we? Yes? Now it's really important for the start of this exercise, we clap the rhythm. So show me those hands. We've got double claps. One, two. Say that with me. One, two. And again. One, two. And again. Now the magic number is eight. So we've got and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. So can you count that with me? Start with and. Ready? And one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. Well done. So you're going to clap the rhythm first, so you know how fast your pony needs to go. Then we will do our gallops. So try that with me, I'll clap with you, then I'll watch your gallop. So are you ready? Clap, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, eight, gallop, one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. Well done. So what you can do is you can go around in a little circle in your living room or your kitchen, but be very careful you don't fall over. So should we try the music? Nice and strong with those hands. Here we go. Here we go. Well done, everybody. Good job. Give yourselves a big clap. We're going to finish off our ballet class today by looking at the sways in the cool down. Now, sways are swaying side to side. And you could sway forwards and backwards. You can sway any way you want, okay? But today, we're going to do it sideways. So hold on to your ballet skirts if you have one. If you don't, you can hold on to your imaginary skirt. Standing into first position, can you say that? First position, well done. And point your right foot to the side and hold your skirts. So you're going to sway, put one foot down, one, point the other one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six with big smiles, and seven, and eight. From there, you close into first position. You're going to rise up on those tippy toes and you're going to take a little run forwards. Run, 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 run. And stand back into first position. And then you're going to do your curtsy. So you're going to hide one foot behind so Miss Charlotte can't see. So hide it behind. Now then, you're going to do your curtsy and look at Miss Charlotte's knees. They point to the side. So I'm making a diamond shape. Okay, so try that again, one foot behind, bend, and back to first position. So that's it there is your cool down. Shall we try with the music? All right, so hold your skirts and point your beautiful foot to the side. Keep growing nice and tall like a beautiful ballerina, a nice long neck, and hold your skirts with your best big point. And Miss Charlotte will get the music, here we go. Ready, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, close, rise, turn, and one foot behind. Well done, everybody. Good job, your cool down was beautiful. Give yourselves a big clap. So we finished our ballet class for today. Thank you so much for joining in with Miss Charlotte. I hope you enjoyed yourself. I'm really missing you all lots and lots and lots, but hopefully, fingers crossed, I'll see you very, very soon. Well done, everybody. Bye.